Martin Pedroza, you got it done here on Indian Winter. You're off to a really good start at this meet, and now you win a stake for a guy like Jerry Hollendorfer. Tell us about your approach to this race and how it went. Uh, well, uh, I just wanted to be close to the pace uh, because horses don't come in from, just don't seem to be coming from a little bit too, too far out of it. So I just want to be with the striking distance. With the, it was about three horses with the speed, and I was comfortable with the three, four, five lines off the pace. The minute I get him in the cage, I'm about to tear, and I was riding, but I don't know. I can't really tell how much the horse in the league got because he was, he was sitting from what I was, and I happened to be riding. So I was a matter if you, I get my horse get tired chasing him, or, you know, he slowed down at the end. And at the end, my horse kind of got a little tired. You can see he was trying to run at that end. He was just tired. He wanted uh -huh. to lay it over the fence. But he managed to get the job done. And he did. Martin, it seems like the times in the tote board today for the main track, they've been a little bit tamer. Have you seen any change? Uh, the track is good. I love it. Horses love it. They run. They're, they're running five because they love it. Martin, I think the biggest concern for you, um, I'm trying to get live horses, but staying sound. Uh, you got off to a good start a couple of years ago, got hurt real bad. How are you doing physically? Uh, physically, I'm doing better than ever. I feel like I'm 18 again. And you're not? <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> uh, maybe three times that. <laughs> but at the Cinco. Anyway, yeah. Martin, uh, off to a great start. Congratulations here. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Buddy. I took better now that I'm more, I got more air. There you go. Now you can breathe. <laughs>